Hey athletes, happy Monday. Hope you guys had an amazing weekend. And I don't know why this is blurry. There we go. <laughs> Hope you guys had an amazing weekend, guys. What I want to do today is talk about why your nutrition plan didn't work, potentially. Uh, I was, saw a post this weekend, and I, well, I've seen a lot of them, but um, one specifically specific one this weekend that she was given the cookie cutter plan. Uh, she was trying something new, it was, and it didn't work for her. And, um, and so I kind of wanted to get on here and talk a little bit about that today as far as why this cookie cutter plan doesn't work for people. Hey, Matt. Hey, John. And that is specifically because your body is unique to you. Uh, you have your basal metabolic rate, which is based on your fat content, your uh, muscle content, just kind of how your body functions in general. Uh, you have your daily energy expenditure, which has to do with your lifestyle, what you do for a job, how much you're moving around during the day, your activity level, um, whether you sit, whether you stand. Hey guys, thanks for hopping on. There's a lot of things that play into how many calories your body burns during the day. There's also a lot of things that play into whether you need uh, more protein or more fat or more carbohydrates and, and how your body tolerates all these foods and processes these foods. So just going um, and getting like this basic plan that's made for everybody with a certain calorie content is not ideal for people. Um, this specific person that I saw this weekend, saw the post about this weekend, was eating significantly under what her basal metabolic rate was which is not even functional. So it's something to think about that if a plan isn't working for you, it's probably not right for your body. Not every um, plan is right for somebody. Uh, some people do keto better. Some people do high protein better. Um, so it just kind of depends on what works for you. Same thing as far as um, vegan versus eating animal proteins. Some bodies just tolerate different things better. For me, um, because of some other food intolerances, I can't, it's really, really hard for me to um, attempt to be vegan because a lot of those protein, um, vegetables that have high proteins, I can't, um, my body doesn't like. So there's just a lot of things that are unique to each person and each, every, single, every single individual that makes nutrition plans have to be unique to yourself as well. So if you're really frustrated because whatever you're doing isn't working for you, it's probably not right for you either the foods aren't right for you or the total calories aren't right for you or maybe the breakdown of um, proteins, carbohydrates, and fats aren't right for you. There's a lot of things, a lot of factors that play into it. So um, if it's not working for you, uh, it's time to reassess, figure out what might not be going right for you. What does your body actually need compared to what it's getting in and then create a new game plan based on that. So let me know what questions you have regarding this. I just want to hop on here real quick and talk about that. Um, any comments you have, any feedback would be awesome. And as usual, feel free to reach out to me on Facebook Messenger. I'd be happy to have a conversation with you. Thanks, everybody, for hopping on and watching. Have a great rest of your Monday, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.